the story that shocked me the most from season two is um, when you said no, 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 hold on. When you right. said that herbal deodorants are non-toxic and that I should be using only herbal deodorants, and I realized at that point that they may be non-toxic, but they don't work because you stink. Oh God, here we you go. You smell. I'm not kidding you. You have an odor issue. Obviously. Of course, that's not true. But I'll tell you what, actually, the most shocking thing is watching you floss your teeth incessantly in the middle of our interviews. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah. But anyway, to answer now, realistically, to answer the question, you have to watch season two because almost every episode is there's shocking. something shocking. Yeah. Okay, I've known my colleague for 15 years, now 16. And one thing about him that most people don't know is, and I got to do this, I have to do this. So if you guys look at our Twitter war, one thing if you take a look at that beautiful high forehead of his, which basically it's a landing strip. In addition, Terry likes to imitate one comedian all the time and does a very weird face and noise, which is that. I'm sorry, I'm not sorry. Okay. When I'm not in surgery, one way I like to spend my free time is? I'll answer that first. Yeah. And no, no, I'm not taking selfies. Which I know exactly. I'm, I'm taking it out. Incessant judging that. and no, selfie taking. No. That All is right. you. My hobbies, besides hanging out with my kids, um, golf. Golf. Well, you already know that because I got to tell you, when I'm on the golf course, for me, we're taking golf lessons, which is a chronic thing that I constantly right. have to do. Um, it takes your mind away from everything. I'm so glad I'm you said guy. chronic, because chronic like a disease, because my understanding of your golf is that you are incredibly bad and you throw clubs. No, I don't. We had 6,000 applicants for surgery this season, and one person I wish had made it onto the show is... Boy. Oh. I actually... I, do, you, do you have one? Yeah. I, <clears throat> there was a person who had, who had had a gastric bypass and lost like 300 pounds. And it was the worst case of body lifting I'd ever seen where sort of the nipples are here and the abdomen, the abdominal scar is there. Just the worst surgery I've ever seen in my life. And this person is so disabled from it that although the case was extraordinarily hard for us, we would have really helped them. And they really need the surgery. They, they didn't clear background because of something. something in their past.